Hey everyone, I'm Jason Jurtich and this is The Mobile Philosopher. In this video, we're going to see how to automatically, with a Google script, create the response spreadsheets for the Google Forms that you've made in the previous video that I've shown you about how to make uh, hundreds or thousands of Google Forms from a Google spreadsheet. So the idea here is to make this automatic so that after you make the forms, this script here will create all of the response spreadsheets without having to open up each one and creating them one by one. So this is a very simple script. And like always, what you're going to do is you're going to have your forms here in your folder already set to go. And then you'll go to new and you'll click on a Google app script here. If you don't have it added, you have to add it first, obviously. Once you open that up, then simply what's going to happen is I am going to obviously put this under the video as a link and, and a public script and you're just going to copy this and then you're going to when you open up yours you're going to have nothing here you're going to have the function thing on top you just simply select whatever is in there you delete it and then you paste the script in here as such okay then here for the get folder by id obviously you're not going to put that one in there it is important that you Make sure you put your your quotation marks here. These can be double or single. It makes no difference. And then you're going to go to the folder where the forms are. And if you click on the folder up on top here, you can actually grab this link here and then copy that guy after the part that says folders here. Just grab that, and then you put that inside the element here. It says get folder by ID. Once that's done, everything else remains exactly the same. You don't have to do anything. You just go over here and save that. We'll zoom out here. After you're done with that, you're going to press the Run button. You can create this, uh, put the name, whatever you want. This doesn't make a difference. But if you just want to copy paste and all that, that's, you can leave that there. Then you click on Run. And the first time, as I mentioned before, when you click on Run, it's going to ask you for permissions. You just press OK and OK. And then when you click on Run, it's going to say running function and this will totally erratically depend upon how many forms you have there so if you only have two like i do it's going to be very quick but if you have many this will take some time and remember that there's a six minute limit i'm working on another script to overcome that but for right now you only have six minutes so you can do if the forms are small maybe 100 maybe 200 depending on how small your forms are if you have forms with 10 to 20 questions, you may only get up to about 40 before this thing dies. So just keep in mind that you'll have between about 50 to 200 forms you can do before the six minute limit is up. So once that's done, <clears throat> you're not gonna see them here. And this is another drawback here, unfortunately, with Google Drive. Working with folders is uh, fairly complex. So when you go in, when you finish the script, you're going to find the response 